We are here. I wonder what that is. 10 got taken out. I was called to help a family with their mountain property, and in the process, I fell in love with it. When I purchased it, I made a promise to rebuild the cabin their grandfather built almost a hundred years ago. It comes with many challenges. With help from my Uncle Mike, we're making it happen. I'm a full-time realtor in Sheridan, Wyoming with an amazing team that covers me for the month of September so I can work on the property. This year was especially challenging, but I'm so grateful to see progress made. We are here at the Cabin in the Sky. Dave, Scott, made the crawl. Pretty view. The hut's been really fantastic. It's just an old well house and it's a cube, but it's insulated, it's got a good door on it, it's dry, and just big enough for two cots to fit in there. So me and Mike, or me and Alex, my son, nice, safe, warm spot. It's definitely made it far more comfortable than the tent. So let me give you a tour. So we pulled this thing from way down the hill with pulleys and ropes and everything else. I'd be lost if it weren't for Dave. Hi, Dave. And uh, dug it literally into the ground, have a nice level spot. But then we also use the super sacks as a sort of a under tarp, which was amazing because now it's gonna be sealed up and uh, hopefully with the positive drainage, as you can see, so when the water comes, the water should flow away. So, but it'll make for a really great, both uh, insulated bedroom. You can see up top how the helicopter brought it in. And uh, it is ventilated, but it's definitely made to stay warm. Perfect size for two large cots, which is really nice and uh, stay out of the weather. Someday we'll put in a, a window, but now that we're heading out, we're gonna pack it full of our stuff. Well, it looks like the tent got taken out. Not sure exactly how or what did it. Hopefully there's not too much damage. I don't see any tears so far other than the top. Could have been just wind. Well, we shall see. For the cold mornings, it's definitely nice to have a hot breakfast. Oof. It's cold up on you, Trent. When we could, we take moments when we could have a campfire, roast marshmallows, hang out by the fire. It wasn't often this year, but when we could, they were certainly a lot of fun. Cause it's a little fun. 